Here's Wilson on first and ten. And this one is incomplete. Finally, a good play there defensively on the deep ball. The secondary has had its struggles this entire game. Offensively, they've had their way with them. He's going to air this out deep for Harvin. A leap, and he will make the catch. And they finally get him down, but not before he reaches the 34. Eluding the pressure right. And he's got his favorite target yet again. It's complete. Touchdown! A great play there with his 28th touchdown. Drawing level with Sean Allen. First down, Wilson. Left side here, taken in by Metcalf. And he'll have it past midfield almost to the 40 before being taken down. They'll look to throw now on first down. A big connection on that one, 39 yards. We sit in quarter number three out in Seattle, a second and 10 now. Looking to throw. Wilson flush to his right. And his throw is incomplete. So now third and ten. A big play to start the drive, but nothing since. To throw again is Wilson. Toward the sideline, and look at that catch. Dragging the toes, and that's going to be a first down. Well done. A big play that time through the air. 33 yards. They'll stick with the passing game as he looks to throw. Flushed out right. End zone caught. Touchdown, Seattle. A great effort there. With touchdown number 29, too short of LaDainian Tomlinson's all-time record, 31. And the Seahawks have taken a... now on first down looking middle and that's complete and they get him down but not before he takes it across the 40 yard line to throw is Wilson throwing on first down and he'll be taken down but not before he works it past the 50 so first and 10 and if they score on this drive might have to start digging in our second half blowout material uh, able to force him out of the pocket right but still able to complete it He'll get this one down near the 20-yard line, just shy of the 20. They'll look to throw again, escaping the pressure right. And it's caught. Touchdown, Seahawks. DK Metcalf from 21 yards away. And the Seahawks get another third-quarter touchdown to add on to that lead. On first and ten, eluding the pressure right. Wide open receiver complete. And he's finally taken down, but not before he reaches the 14. From the red zone now, here's Wilson on first down. And this is going to be intercepted. Good positioning, and it's picked off. And the Ravens are going to take possession here. It's a tight. shake off the interception from the last drive he'll look to throw and that is caught one handed oh my he pulled it in so that play much needed there as they're all the way up near the 40 for a first and 10 flush to his right 
and completes it again to Metcalf. And he'll be taken down, but not before he gets into enemy territory. They'll look to throw here on first down. Oh, there's that man again. It's complete. This will be stopped about two yards shy of the marker. Eight-yard gain, second and two. Complete to Wheaton. And quickly, they get to the line. Again, he'll drop the throw. Over the middle, that's caught by Metcalf. And he gets this one inside the 15, just a yard or two shy of the 10. On first down, he'll drop to throw. Forced out to his left. And that is incomplete. Oh, the coverage a little too good there, and it's second down. So after the incompletion on first, now second and 10. Back to throw again. Well, that'll be incomplete. Well, he took a shot as he let that go. And it's going to bring up a third down. This offense was on the move. Now two straight incompletions have him looking at third and ten. And give him another six. It's caught for a touchdown. And the blowout continues. Well, they just continue to roll. And wants to throw it and he'll be hit as he releases it and that'll fall incomplete so the incompletion and now it's second and ten again from the 25 yard line throwing again Wilson flushed out right that's into the hands of Parkinson the tight end and they get him down but not before he takes it across the 40 yard line on first down Wilson Throwing right, and that's complete. Now he's going to get this all the way down inside the 35. And they're going to speed things up here. Wilson on first down. And incomplete on the deep ball. Fourth quarter, you've got the big lead. If you're coaching, Charles, you, you still taking shots like that downfield? I'd be a little more concerned with running some clock and making sure you're taking care of the lead because you keep... Now a clash of bodies here, and it's intercepted. Picked off down near the five. Well, they're not making it easy on themselves here down the stretch. Two picks now in the fourth quarter trying to hang on to that lead. Talk about keeping someone in the game. Instead of being able to shut the door, it's still cracked open because they can come back on you now. The only people are really happy about those picks, any fantasy team that has this defense. Now the Seahawks going to use the first of their timeouts. It's just their first. They've got two more to use here in the final stages. Second and four. Oh, man over the middle, and it's complete. Now the Seahawks call the second of their three timeouts. That'll leave them with just one remaining in this fourth quarter of play. Back to throw now on first down. On oh, this one incomplete. The pressure got to him as he released it. And it's second down. So now second and ten after the incompletion on first down. Back to throw. And he fires one that's intercepted. Picked off around the 37. And he's able to get it back to the 33-yard line. Yet another mistake after the interception there. And gosh, you look up at the scoreboard, they just got to be thinking this one cannot get over fast enough. It certainly can't. And also what happens when you get this big of a deficit, you're supposed to make all the right throws, right? You're supposed to try and obviously get the ball to your own guys. But being down this big, you also take even more chances. And in this situation, that hasn't paid off for them at all. On the other sideline, jubilation and laughter. And it's intercepted at the goal line. Able to get there and pick it. And the Ravens are going to have it here at their own nine-yard line. Now they get a fourth-quarter pick. Big offense.
offensive explosion help leading them to victory. And the defensive guys, they're just saying, hey, put those points up every week. We'll just keep winning. They will gratefully accept them, won't they? It makes their job that much easier when they're scoring that many points. Allows them to play with a totally different style and a different flow. So for the Seahawks, they finish off the regular season at 12 up and five down. And now they'll await the final seeding for the playoffs ahead. Meanwhile, for Baltimore, they once again fail in their quest to find a victory as they finish off maybe the worst season in NFL history. I hate to say that, but it's true.